Organizers with the Plastics Industry Association say that 45% of attendees will be first timers here at NPE. New people who haven't been to the show before don't know what to expect, so opening their eyes on what the industry is capable of, but also the demographic. I think there's a pretty marked change since COVID. A lot of people have opted not to come back into the workplace. And with that, younger people are moving in to help backfill the entry level positions and others have aged up mm -hmm. or advanced. I remember my first NPE was 2000 in Chicago. And I was astounded at how much there was to see, how many aisles, how many different kinds of equipment, materials, processors were all there. And then that was just one hall. I discovered there's a whole new building after the first day. <laughs> the biggest tip I have for first time attendees is wear comfortable shoes. If you think that you can easily see the show in one day, you can't. It is a two, maybe three day experience. And I strongly encourage you to see the whole thing. There is stuff in the south to the west, the sustainability hub, you name it. There's so much to see and I encourage you to make it a priority. It's just a short walk between the North-South building and the West building. There's also skyways that connect North-South to hotels and West to hotels. There's also a shuttle bus if you get tired and just want to take a short ride rather than a short walk between the two. No one expects you to cover NPE in one day. You know, I know it sounds silly, but if you're an attendee and you have two days to spend here, take the two days. I, you know, walk the hall go up and down the rows, obviously target the people that you want to see, but there's a lot of really cool stuff here. Um, set up a My NPE Planner, and that's where you can um, highlight the exhibitors you wanna go see or the sessions that you wanna go see or try to connect with exhibitors to set up appointments. Okay. And, and prepare for climate. I mean, while it might be hot during move-in, it could be cool inside once we start getting the air conditioning going on show day. So bring a sweater mm -hmm. or a light jacket. Um, the shoes are critically important. Yeah, shoes are critical. Um, hydrate, you know, bring your own water bottle. There'll be water filling stations around or pick up water mm -hmm. um, it, in somebody's booth if they're giving it to you or yeah. certainly at any of the food outlets. Um, hydration in an exhibit hall is super important just because the air is so dry.